Now, in this video, we will learn that how we can find the amplitude of accommodation. We have discussed many times about the amplitude of accommodation. You know that the amplitude of accommodation is actually the ability of an eye to accommodate maximum. Right? That how much an specific eye can accommodate. That peak of accommodation is called the amplitude of accommodation. Right? Now, in this video, we will uh, we have discussed about that we can find amplitude of accommodation with the help of the RF rule. We have detailed videos regarding the RF rule, right? And we have discussed every inch of the RF rule, right? That how we can find amplitude of accommodation with the RF rule, and, uh, near point of convergence, near point of accommodation, and all, right? And now in this video, we are going to learn that how we can find that amplitude of accommodation without the help of the RF rule. Right, and we have Hofstadter's formula, right? And we have three different formulas. The video is very simple. This formula, this is 25 minus 0 0.4 and into h. This is for maximum. If you want to find the maximum amplitude of accommodation in any patient, the formula is that. And if you want the average amplitude of accommodation in a specific age, in any age, I must say, this is the formula for average amplitude of accommodation and if you want to find the minimum amplitude of accommodation in any age you can simply put that formula right for minimum amplitude of accommodation and now we will find the maximum amplitude of accommodation average amplitude of accommodation and minimum amplitude of accommodation in a specific age right suppose our patient's age is 40 years and in 40 years, we want to calculate the maximum average and minimum amplitude of accommodation, right? So for maximum amplitude of accommodation, we will put our formula, which is 25 minus 0 0.4 into age. And our patient's age is 40 years, right? And when we multiply 0 0.4 into 40, the answer would be 16. You can use your calculator. Now, 25 minus 16 would be 9. So, 9 at age of 40 years, the maximum amplitude of accommodation is 9. Right? And now, another example. Now, at 40 years of age, we will find the average amplitude of accommodation. And the formula is simple 18.5 minus 0 0.3 into h now age is age is 40 years and 0 0.3 into 40 is 12 now we will subtract 12 from 18.5 and the answer would be 6.5 so in 40 years of age our total amplitude of accommodation which is average is 6.5 right now what for the minimum amplitude of accommodation the formula is simple 15 minus 0 0.25 into h right now age is 40 years so first we will multiply we will multiply 0 0.25 into 40 and the answer would be 10 and when we subtract 10 from 15 the answer would be 5 and now in 40 years of age the minimum amplitude of accommodation is 5 you can vary your age it could be 20 years 10 years 5 years right you can put these formulas which is called the Hofstadter's formulas and you can find maximum average and minimum amplitude of accommodation